you. That was such a lovely introduction. I was wondering who she was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Yeah. On the behalf of the Satya Sai Baba Center of Raleigh, I thank you so much for this recognition. We are honored and humbled to be here among you this evening. We would like to thank many community partners that we have, that we worked with in the past and continue to work. And these are the people that make our activities possible. We couldn't do this without all of you guys. Um, our service activities are inspired by the life and message of our spiritual teacher, Satya Sai Baba. Satya Sai Baba showed to humanity the path to realize one's own divine nature, respecting the universal spiritual teachings common to all religions. He said, let the different faiths exist. Let them flourish. Let the glory of God be sung in many languages and in a variety of tunes. That should be the ideal. Respect the differences between the faiths and recognize them as valid as long as they do not extinguish the flame of unity. His legacy of service to mankind is our inspiration. He provided free, state-of-the-art health care to millions of people, from primary care to tertiary care. He provided free education from elementary school to doctoral degree education. He provided free drinking water to millions of people in South India who otherwise had no access to clean water. <clears throat> and he established innumerable free community services such as free food, clothing, shelter, and disaster relief to people all over the world. Satya Sai Baba taught us, quotes, if you lift the hand to serve, to help, to console, to encourage another man, you are lifting it for God. For God is in every man, end quote. We aspire to live these words and put them into action. So in that spirit, we thank you once again for this honor. Thank you.